Hello, I'm Matt and welcome to Badger Workshop. So I've been asked to make a wooden sleigh. Now, probably I'd go with plywood for this, but I haven't got any and it's really expensive at the moment. But what I do have is a couple of scaffold boards, so I'm going to use those. I've drawn out a rough plan, so now I can get the bits cut down to basic dimensions using the jigsaw. But they're really twisted, so I'm going to try and flatten them the best I can using a scrub plane. I don't just need to glue some boards together because that'd be wasteful. I just need one long one and then a couple of shorter bits at either end to get the shape so I can get them glued and clamped up. So I left these overnight to dry, now I've got the clamps off. Now I can get my design drawn out onto one of them. So I can get the design drawn out using a ruler to do the simple bits and then I've got a flexible ruler to try and help with more of the intricate curved bits. When I'm happy with the design, I'm just going to shade in the bits I want to remove so I don't make any mistakes. Then I'm going to get some holes drilled and use the jigsaw to remove the waste. So I've got one side cut out and I think it kind of looks like a slate. So now I'm going to use this as a template and draw around it on the other side. Then I can do the same thing again, using the jigsaw to cut it out, drilling some holes and cutting out these delicate bits. So I've got the two sides cut out, but the shape is pretty flat. So I want to add a bit more dimension to it by using a gouge and a rasp just to shape these curves a little. So I've got the two sides done, now I want to join them together and I'm going to use some more scaffold boards. I think I want the gap between them to be about 30 centimetres, so I'm going to use the mitre gauge to get the pieces cut. and then to attach them, I'm gonna use some glues and screws. So first, I'm gonna drill some pilot holes that are countersunk so that I can come back and plug those later. So it's all put together, now I need to plug these holes. So I've drilled out some plugs, got them popped out, now I can get a bit of glue, put in all the holes, and them tapped into place. 
Then when they're dry, I can trim them flush and give the whole thing a sand down. So that's as much as I'm doing with it, because now it can go off to its new home and they can paint and decorate it and make it look all Christmassy and nice. Now, if you used to do this, I definitely wouldn't recommend scaffold boards, but I was doing this as a bit of a favour, so I was just using what I had. It's definitely just a decorative piece and should never be used as a sled, but I think it'll look cool by a Christmas tree full of gifts. So, thanks for watching. Thanks to my patrons and please subscribe for more videos.